Morning guys, how are we doing? Welcome to another Buzzing About Tan, and today I, I'm so excited. I've been here 11 years, um, I've done quite a lot of things over those years here, but I've never ever been up there. And today, yes, above me, I'm going to go flying high uh, above the John Tien area today. Uh, we can't do the Patera area simply because it's too early, uh, but you can do that later on if you come back in the afternoons. But for me today, as you know, I'm an early bird, I like to get up and early, and uh, I'm going to come down here and try and experience what this place here, the BFA the Burupa Tid Flying Association can do. Um, basically, we're gonna go up in the air, we're gonna have a, a, a fly around the area, around Jom Chen, and see what's going on. And I'm really out, I can't wait to, I saw, I've seen a few videos of this place, and this place, honestly, I think this is a definite, if you're gonna come out here, uh, and you wanna explore from above, and have a look around, this is an absolute must do. And uh, I'm really excited, I'm really looking forward to it. And I uh, don't know what to expect, to be honest with you, really, truthfully, not sure. Uh, but they're open uh, every day, and I'll share all the details in the description link down below. I'm also going to do a 360 video. So if you want to do, uh, if you want to have a look in the description, I'll share that video where you can control it with your fingers and uh, on your mobile phone, or you can use the mouse and control it on your computer. Uh, but we'll see how that goes. All right, so let's go and see what is going to happen to me today. I think we're going to be about 700 feet up high. But whew, anyway, let's go take it out. All right, guys. So here we are. Woohoo! Look at this. We are airborne. You know, I've lived here in Pattaya 11 years. Never ever done this. And I'm asking myself why? Why have I not done this? The view is incredible. We're looking at the distance there. Now we're heading over past the lakes. This is what's commonly known as the east side of Pattaya. The dark side as we call it. And you can see for the first time ever, I'm going to see a bird's eye view of the new stadium. But sadly, it's come to a halt. They've been putting that together for years now. Look at that, wow. Everything's going in slow mode. Really quite surreal. I'm so used to running around on my motorbike or walking around and showing you something's going on. And yet here, it's just like time stood still. And that's a really nice thing as well, because it gives me an opportunity to be able to look around and take in everything that's going on. And I'm sure as we get further across, you know, Patea, John Chen, all around this area, there's so much development going on. People say to me, oh, the city's dead, it's over. I'm thinking, no, 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 have a look at this. There you are, look at that down there. That's the football stadium. I came up here about a year ago. And nothing's changed. I don't know what's going to happen with that. I don't know whether they're going to ever finish it off or whether it's come to a complete standstill. It looks like they've got to redo it, knock it down, start again. And over that direction, yeah, that's heading over there towards Jom Tien. This is brilliant. like the little houses there, you get the idea now as to how big these areas are. See the boats there, the speed boats down there. We used to have, remember years and years ago, we used to have all the speed boats down at Valley High Pier. And they were cleared off a while back. I guess that's where they're coming out here now, st static storage. Brain's racing over time now, I'm trying to think. Well, I wonder what's there, I wonder what's over there. And like I say, when you ride around on your bike, you don't really get a true appreciation 
bumper to the sides of this way, look at it. Trying to figure out my bearings now, what's my bearings? Uh, where are we? Okay, so there's the Riviera straight in front over there on the right side. And it's so peaceful, it's like, there's no turbulence, nothing like that. It's really nice, a nice breeze. So, so stable. And for those of you that got a fear of heights or think, oh no, I couldn't do that, honestly guys, I'm strapped in, I'm in a really nice enclosed sort of uh, steel structure. You're not going anywhere. And this is, I mean, I'm looking down there, that's, that's amazing, look at that. And we're flying at a height of around about 700 foot, which is high enough that you can still see all the detail if you're looking down. I'll tell you what's surprising me a lot as well is I can see a lot of lake structures now, a lot more lakes than I even knew were here. And this just goes to show you about, you know, you can live somewhere for a long time, you can think you know it, and then when you're up above it, looking down, it's like, wow. And over on the far right-hand side over there, see the uh, John Tien water park, the tower, the zip line? Remember when I went down that? Well, I'm a lot higher now than what that is. If I show you down on the street level, you see it's all happening, people going about their day, going to work. Look over there. We've redeveloped the road. Oh man, this is so good. making a 360 uh, video at the same time as doing this. I'll put that link in the description below and that'll give you the opportunity to uh, load that video and just spin it around. You can be in control of what you want to look at. If you're using your mobile phone, just tilt your phone or swipe it with your finger. There's a helicopter pad on top of that one. Look at that. And that's when you know you've made it, when you come home and you arrive by helicopter. Well, Guys, let's see if we can get the channel up to enough members that I can get one of these and we can do a completely different style of video. I think we need a few quid for that. That's the area we've just come back from. We've come from over there. I'll put all the description and everything in the details down below in the video. Uh, but they're open seven days a week, seven days. They start early, finish about 8 p.m. in the evening. And I can honestly say, without sounding like a bit of a robot and keeping beating myself, this is fantastic. And it just goes to re-emphasize the fact that, you know, all the talk about developing and building the city up and changing the structure. There's so much area available to do this. Straight down there, I think that's called a Whale Marina, I think, on the top of my head. I might be wrong, so don't hold me to it. But right there in the distance, you see that little estuary leading in. I'm pretty sure that's well. I went to look at that years ago, you know, investing in a, in a condo here. Still building and developing the road there. They've done a massive work with the roads around. The new infrastructure with the road system is amazing. And look at that complex there, see the complex. All the blue and green roofs.
looking ahead and somewhere, I have absolutely no idea where, but somewhere is the landing strip. So, uh, yeah. My eyes are terrible, I've got no idea where the landing strip is. At least if you're flying to Heathrow or Gatwick, they've got big concrete runways. Out here, I don't know where we're going. Right. Oh, right, down there. Okay. Right. Okay. Oh, so we're above where we took off from, guys. And, uh, We've slowed down now, so we're gradually just drifting down. Yeah, no worries. We're gradually just drifting down now, so uh, here we go. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Here we go. Oh, have some of that, guys. Oh, my God. Here we go. Oh, my Lord. That was great. Ian, don't do this. You would be crying like a baby right now. <laughs> that was quality. All right, so we're heading in. We're going to head out. Oh, that's where we're going. See them hangars over there? That's where we're going to go and land. Well, that's the plan anyway. <laughs> All right, here we go. Look at that. That was something else. I must admit, I had a little bit of a tense moment then, because my feet were really close to the ground. <laughs> Perfect, look at that, brilliant. All right, I'm gonna turn the camera off and I'll be back with you in a second. Wow, what can I say? Unbelievable, that was just amazing. Um, that really was just something. I didn't expect it to be as smooth as it was. Um, it was just like we we're in like a time capsule. Everything was just slowed right down and it was just so great because you could see everything around behind you and, and down below and look all around. Um, it really was fantastic. Getting to see things that I've, you know, like I say, when you're up that height, you see things that you just never would ever imagine that you would see. And uh, definitely 100% guys, get down, have a look at this. So I'll put all their links in the description down below. Get in contact with them, come and do this. You know, you come out here for year and year and years and all the rest of it but maybe you never come and do this. And this is an absolute must. It was 20 minutes. Uh, it was a really nice, easy flowing uh, journey. We got a, bit, uh, got a bit excited near the end when we, we were doing a couple of barrel rolls nearly for me. I've got to be honest, secretly I shit myself, but I won't, uh, I won't admit that anyway. But yeah, it was quite, uh, quite interesting. So uh, very, very skilled pilots, um, you know, the, the, the complete safety in mind. Everything was all good. There was no risks. It was really just quite, well, it was absolutely brilliant to be fair and uh, highly highly recommend so guys please have a look down in the description below get in touch they're open monday to sunday seven days a week uh, they they start very early but if you come here in the early hours uh, you have to be aware that they can't go into the city center for noise obviously uh, they'll get complaints but you can go to the potato maybe like late afternoon and take in maybe have a look around at where you're going to be in a few hours after you've had the flight but uh, come down really nice people really nice service very very professional and highly recommended Right, so I need to go and get a coffee now. I think my nerves are blown. <laughs> I'm AJ. Brilliant, really was good. So, so good. All right, that's it for me, guys. Thank you very much indeed for watching. Please, as always, remember, hit the subscribe button and also the bell icon if you'd like to be notified when I bring in a new video. Uh, have a look on Discord. I have 10,000 members on there now, so it's going from strength to strength. Please have a look on that. It's totally free of charge. And uh, I will put the links to what we've done here uh, today in Discord as well, so you can see it there if you don't catch it on YouTube. And if you'd like to support the channel, there's a link to our members area down below, and your support is much appreciated. All right, that's it for me. Thank you very much, Lee, for watching. And please, as always, wherever you are in the world, stay safe. Mm -hmm.